<laughs> oh, can you smell that? <laughs> oh, that's naughty. We've been naughty. <laughs> oh, he's living it. I wish I had my video because my lad would love it. <laughs> oh, amazing, mate. Okay, so first off, I want to say a shout out to Squarespace for sponsoring today's vlog. So here are some clips of about six months ago in this garage. Let's do this! Absolutely mental. So yeah, now as you can see, it's a little bit of a, a mess. So I want to make a cool room in here, essentially something like a gym or slash getaway room. I haven't really got too much of an idea yet. So yeah, the floor is kind of really dirty. Dirty to the fact that we plastered the roof and now this foamy flooring that we put down has got all huge bits of plaster over it. So it's kind of a ruined project. I think the main problem is the amount of furniture that's actually in this room. There's two like little love seats and then there's some kitchen seats that were in the kitchen at one point and now aren't. And I just don't really need them anymore. So I'll probably just stick them on Facebook Marketplace and try and get somebody to come and pick them up. Somebody that will actually use them and or need them. Then we'll have the space to actually well, think. <laughs> cool. <laughs> cool. The roof needs a good solid day sorting on it. But. So that is the current state of the garage. We filmed loads of stuff for it last year and it just kind of all fell through. We just stopped. One thing I'm really looking forward to is actually having some gym equipment at my house because then I can, oh, I can do little bits here and not have to go to the gym. Bless you, Atlas. I've seen this look check out this this well it's a it's a jacket that I received yesterday all the way from America check this out so the guys over at work hard anywhere actually got this custom done for me and put the flag on it look check this out how awesome is this so guys, I'm back in office number one, office number two, the room next door, completely stressing me out. Your guys' fault, by the way. I saw a few people in the comment section saying that I keep repeating myself, saying that I'm going to do things and then not actually doing them. But one of the main things I wanted to do in the room next door was actually have some sort of pull-down system where I can sort of pull down any colour on a sheet. And to be honest, in my head that sounds really, really easy to do, but I have no idea. I don't even know if I'm going to have to build something or if I could just type something into Google or Amazon and just buy it. And obviously I'm gonna have to try and get huge sheets of like every single color, green, red, blue, orange, so you've got all the colors there to pull down and they're gonna have to be huge. I just want you guys to know, I'm not saying these things just for the sake of saying them. These are things that I actually want to happen, but you guys need to understand that these things, they don't just happen like that. <laughs> like anything good guys, it takes time, energy and effort. There is one thing though that I really do need to apologize for and that is that before Christmas, over on my Twitter, I actually did a Pixel giveaway for a Google Pixel phone. Now I said I was gonna pick the winner for Christmas and it's now the end of January and I still haven't picked the winner. Maybe I should just be a little bit more honest with you guys, maybe I should just tell you things, but I actually misplaced the device that I was giving away. I lost it, I thought I'd thrown it out, but I have now, as of yesterday, found it. So an hour after this video goes live over on my Twitter, the winner will be announced. And then I'm gonna do a little mini giveaway to say sorry for this video. Okay guys, I'm gonna buy a set of these Sony Mark III headphones. These are my favorite headphones from Sony. So it's just to say thank you to you guys. Drop a like rating on the video and drop your funniest joke down in the comments and then my next vlog I will reveal the funniest joke or whatever makes me laugh and I'll reveal the winner. Today is going to be a car video because I've had my car back now and it's been wrapped for about a week and a half. I'm absolutely loving it. I told you guys I was going to get it wrapped and people on Twitter and Facebook and Instagram have been like, Alex, where's the car? What have you done to it? I'm on my way to town right now because I'm meant to be meeting Ty. Now, but I don't necessarily have an office where I go to every day and meet a handful of people that I can interact with. So when I have an opportunity to meet up with another creator, somebody that does what I do, well, I welcome that opportunity with open arms. Because I think this can be said no matter what you do, no matter what field you're in, knowledge is power. Ah, uh, I always get stuck behind the lorries. Okay, so Ty, whenever we meet, for whatever reason, we always just go to the top of this car park, because why not? Mate, what do you think of the car? Oh, it looks so good. I'm it looks jealous. good. <laughs> uh, it looks so good. 
Oh man, I'm jealous. Good, okay, that's that out of the way. I'm gonna go sell my car. <laughs> but mate, the uh, question to you is that do I put this back on the back of the car? Or not? You've got, you've, you've got, you've got to flex it, haven't you? Yeah. So I think Ty's hit the nail on the head. He's pretty much said that this is the stealth mobile now, because oh, yeah. before it was like it was just completely crazy, wasn't it? Yeah. Like head turning when it came down the road, and I kind of like that for a bit, but it's time to put that to bed now. Time to stop that. So we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to pay for some car parking tickets. <laughs> But we definitely weren't, we weren't going to come here. We weren't going to come all the way out to Lincoln without having a cheeky Nando's. It'd be rude not to. It'd be rude not to. It would be rude not to. <laughs> Ty's just pointed out, and I think I do this every single time I flick this camera into slow motion. I start filming and I just start making sound effects. But the thing is, the camera doesn't record sound when it's in slow motion, so it sort of defeats the object. But you know I'm doing it now, so it's the thought that counts. <laughs> Okay, so Nando's all finished. Unfortunately, it is kind of windy on top of this parking lot, but I want to show you guys the car. Everybody was looking at me. I drive the car down the road and everybody would just stare at it. And that's kind of nice, but I just wanted a change. So we've gone black. It looks so, 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 so stealthy. I've even sort of tinted the front, the front lights as well. Hey, wait, what's going on? Whoa! skits that we've just recorded and all of the cool shots that we've just got this is actually my brand new wrapped BMW M2 competition. As you can see, I've just gone matte black. Now, my main worry when actually getting this wrap done was the fact that people were gonna call me boring, but you have to remember, I have driven around in this and this, so like now I just, I just want a little bit of peace and quiet. I want something stealthy. I want something that people probably aren't gonna stare at unless they really know what they're talking about and they like cars. But yeah, here you go. This thing looks awesome. I've also had some other stuff done too. So you lot will be able to notice this as well. This is actually carbon fiber on here. Now you can pay like 500 pounds to get carbon fiber, real carbon fiber wingtips. However, this is just a wrap. So I've sort of faked it till I've made it. Kind of. And also across the back as well, the car came with this tiny little itty ditty spoiler, which has also been wrapped in carbon fiber, which just sets it off against the matte of the actual body of the car. The BMW badges have also been wrapped matte black, so the thing is essentially just a phantom. The last thing that's been wrapped is the roof. It's also black as well, but it's gloss black and it plays really nicely with the matte black of the car. And you can see this on the front grille as well, because the front grille is all glossy. It looks Awesome, I'm super, super over the moon with it. So if you see me around, please feel free to say hi. I don't bite, but I do rev my engine. Was that nice closure? Yeah, I guess. <laughs> Sweet. One, two, three, four. Five, six, nine, Smell that. <laughs> oh, that's naughty. We've been naughty. <laughs> oh, he's living it. I wish I had my video because my lad would love it. <laughs> oh, amazing, mate. Does he like his cars, does he? Oh, he loves it. Well, I like my cars as well, but you know what I mean? When you got a mortgage and stuff, you got to pay for tyres. Yeah, of course. It? Cheers, mate. See you soon. All right. Are you ready? Okay, I have finally made it home after seeing Ty today. I've had a really fantastic day. I've really, really enjoyed it. There is actually a few more things that I could show you guys about this car. Now, I made an entire video about this over on TechFlow, the tech mods that I've actually done to this car. So I'll put a link to that video in the description or you can click the card to go and watch that, to go and see all the tech mods that I've done to this car. But one of them is the fact that I now have an entire library of music videos that I can play 
on here. Right, that's enough of that before I get a copyright strike. There's loads more mods too, guys, like the huge custom install of this 12 inch subwoofer in the boot. If you guys are into your tech mods, I would go and watch that video. Actually, annoyingly, I bought this lava snow foam cannon to wash my car with, and it doesn't fit on the end of my jet wash, which is a shame. But regardless of that, and I know I'm stood in my driveway in the dark talking and you can't really see it, but I really hope you guys like the car because I think it's awesome. Go! Good boy, you're such a good boy! Right, so I appreciate that it's really, really dark right now, but I think a lot of you are going to find this really interesting. So if I walk over here, hopefully, there we go. We should get some light. Now, how did that just happen? And can you guys see that little ball up there that's flashing? Well, that is actually a motion sensor. Now, if I use my phone light, I can hopefully show you that on the side of this cabinet here, can you see it there? There's the shadow. There's a huge button. So if I press that, hopefully the light should come on. Wicked. And here's an example of one of these little buttons that you can literally put anywhere and just... Now, if I press this button twice, it should turn everything off. Sick. Now, if you go upstairs, there's actually a little motion sensor in this dude's eyeball, which now it has sensed to me has turned on the nano leaf light panels. And also, if I walk into my office backwards, there you go. Motion sensor, lights are on. So, guys, it's getting kind of late now. I don't know if you've noticed, but I've uh, started making vlogs again on a more regular basis. So, with that being said, guys, I have really enjoyed making today's video. I hope you've enjoyed watching it. It's time to bring this thing to a closure now. And if that's the case, then I need to thank today's sponsor. You see this website here that automatically resizes no matter what screen you put it on? Well, this is actually one of my websites, Mars Media. This is my main website and I made it using Squarespace. As you guys know, I don't usually sponsor my vlogs, but Squarespace, I just use them in my day-to-day -day life. So if you guys want to make a website, they sort out the domain. They have things on there like analytics so you can see how long people are staying on your website. You can even do e-commerce and sell things on your Squarespace website. And to top it off when you're actually making your website, they've got thousands of templates to choose from. So you choose a template, roll with that, and then upload all of your own text and images. Make it yours, make it count. I've got my own custom link in the description, squarespace.com forward slash marsbarvlogs, or use code marsbar at checkout. And that will get you 10% off your first Squarespace purchase. But with that being said, guys, I need to go and figure out all of this smart home stuff because tomorrow for me, well, I'm making a video on all of that. So I need to figure it out. But for now, my name's been Alex, and I suppose I'll see you in another one. Thanks for watching. Adios.